Oh, look at this lovely woman. Who is this? Hello. I'm in charge. Ah, Buzzy. Charge. A lot of American families wouldn't do this, but we here at the Gibbons Group love one another. This is my family. And we love real estate. My brother and I work together in real estate. My mother and father have been in real estate for 45 years, buying, selling, investing, being landlords. And it's just something that's been in our blood since we were kids. But recently, it has gotten even more difficult than it was before. Ideally, what you have is this be all cash, making like this, right? right? And then when I went to finance it, it would break even so that it yeah, stands alone. Yeah, I got it. And got then it. you got another one. And then when these can refi down to five, six percent, then we're looking there, good. You have two cash flowing assets, and then I can refinance that one okay. and take more money out to buy another one. Our biggest problem is finding good properties to flip, rent, and renovate as a family. And in this current market, it is proving to be very difficult to find a good deal. We try very hard not to overpay. It's on the market for $900,000. It's pretty have to get this house for $100,000 under asking, and I don't know if that's possible. Okay. Our entire business model is built on keeping expenses low, labor costs low, doing any renovations that we can do as DIYers, and trying not to pull permits and do anything drastic that will take too much time. Open concept, baby! No. The ultimate goal is to find good homes in great neighborhoods that we can fix up, put our style and taste into, and rent them and cover all of the expenses for the home, including taxes, insurance, and mortgage. And with the increase in prices and with so few homes on the market in the past couple of years, this has proven to become very difficult for us. And that's only one half of the business. The other half of the business is where the real fun starts. This has never been clean, I'm willing to bet. Oh my gosh. That's Just walk around it. <laughs> and you can laugh. <laughs> If you're thinking about investing in real estate, you need to strap yourself in and get ready for the ride. Everything's going to break. Houses are going to fall apart. Contractors will just decide not to show up. People will be late. Tenants won't pay. You're going to go crazy. You're going to have to replace appliances with a quick turnaround time. And on and on the problems go. But it beats a desk job. So why could buying real estate be a bad idea? Because it all depends on you. Can you handle extreme stress? Can you handle extreme financial pressure? Can you move quickly, work efficiently, and help problem solve? If you plan on investing in real estate and being a landlord, you must know that it comes at a sacrifice. There is no PTO. There are no vacation days. This is a circus of a life, and it is a lifestyle choice that you must be prepared to take on. So our resolution is to keep buying real estate, keep buying assets, and keep moving forward because once this market changes, we will refinance and we will continue to buy more assets, creating generational wealth for our family.